Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. What's up everybody? We are students at Technical Trainers College in Riyadh and we made this video in regards to the technical vocational education in Saudi Arabia. As you might know, Saudi Arabia in the past started educating their generation poorly in compared to what we have nowadays from different teaching methods, modern learning materials, teacher roles and so on. In the past, teachers were putting a lot of efforts teaching their students. The only method which was used in the classroom was lecturing. Lecturing is pretty boring for the students due to the fact that the students have different learning style. And also, lecturing takes a lot of time. For example, small idea can be described several ways to be understood clearly. Not to mention that the past learning materials were using holy books, whiteboards, and blackboards. Teachers were and still role modules to the students. They are typically do not think of themselves as role modules. However, inadvertently, they are. Students spend a great deal of time with their teacher, and therefore, the teacher becomes a role module to them. This could be a positive or negative effect, depending on the teacher. Teachers are there not only to teach the generation, but also to take care for them. Teachers are typically highly respected by people in the community and therefore become a role model to the students and parents. Knowing that we are concentrating on the technical vocational education, workshops has been concerned as well. Technical institutions and colleges established in Saudi Arabia to increase the amount of the incoming of the country and build up a professional generation. A training workshop is a type of interactive training where participants carry out a number of training activities rather than passively listen to a lecture. Theory provides the basis of knowledge for any course the students study. But while having a theoretical knowledge is important, practical education is more interactive and could help the students learn and understand more. As the saying goes, practice makes perfect. And incorporating practical skills into their studies was proven to help the students learn better, gain a better understanding of the work, and even gain employment. During the time, technical vocational education has progressed a lot more in compared to 15 years ago. And believe it or not, despite the technical vocational education has been progressed, we still use books and whiteboards as well as the method lecturing. In regard to the learning materials, the technical vocational education now is using modern learning materials such as computers, smartboards, smartphones, projectors, and e-books even. With the help of all of this stuff, the teacher should not be in the center or under the spot like we used to in the past. Nowadays, students are being in the center instead, and the teacher may walk around the class to support the students who ever need help. Learning materials are also considered in workshops by bringing more manufacturing equipment which will help the generation to support the incoming of Saudi Arabia in the future. Regarding the teaching methods, we are living in a world that cares about the learning style of each student. For example, a lesson can be taught in different teaching methods like using lecturing, demonstration, robot, 
classroom conversation, individual work, and so on. Touching the teacher rules, we have known more rules should be played, like teaching knowledge. The most common rule a teacher plays in the classroom is to teach knowledge to the students. Teachers are giving a curriculum they must follow that meets state guidelines. This curriculum is followed by the teacher so that throughout the year, all pertinent knowledge is dispensed to the students. Teachers teach in many ways, including lectures, small group activities, and hands-on learning activities. All right, we are getting closer to what we are looking for in the future in regards to 2030 vision of Saudi Arabia. One of the most considerable issues for teaching students is the distance. However, there is a solution for that already, which is a distance learning. Although this hasn't been very common yet, in 2030 vision, Saudi Arabia surely will develop that. And this can help the students save money, time, and even the students can revision their courses anytime they want. Knowing that the main focus in education is the students, so in 2030 vision, we can visualize that the education will concentrate on giving the students the feeling of what they are learning, whether they are studying mathematics, geographic, physics, chemistry, or even technically, automotive, production, and so on. In some of what has been said in this video, we went through the development of the technical vocational education in Saudi Arabia, mainly dropping the spot on three things, which were teaching methods, learning materials, and teacher rules. We hope you enjoyed our video. Thanks for watching.